Hi guys, good morning and welcome back to TechFix Info. Today's video is on troubleshooting of engine smoke. If there's a black smoke coming from your engine, how to troubleshoot it? What can be the possible reasons? How to get over it? How to repair your vehicle? Everything is covered in this video. So watch the entire video. This video is made in three steps. First is analysis, second is checks and third is troubleshooting. So this will be three different videos as a series I will be uploading. So keep subscribed to us for watching all the videos. So first we'll talk about analysis here. The highest probability region uh, for the chance of black smoke will be discussed about and we'll come to an idea why it is happening. So the general causes for uh, engine black smoke is insufficient intake of air. If sufficient air is not there, as you know, there's a balance for air and fuel. So insufficient intake of air can cause black smoke excessive fuel same the fuel air balance is changing black smoke abnormal fuel injection conditions can give you black smoke improper selection of fuel petrol to diesel or vice versa or more corrosion or corroded fuel black smoke engine overheating engine overheating itself is another topic which we will discuss later but if there is an engine overheating it will be associated with the black smoke controller issue that is an electrical issue if your controller is faulty the fuel supply will get affected so an electrical issue can really cause a black smoke in the engine so these are the general causes now uh, this video we are planning like if you're a mechanic you can use this video tips or even if you are a normal car enthusiast or just a customer who is having a car you can use just follow the tips so if you are a mechanic you should ask the driver or the customer these things and come to an idea before starting your own checks okay so let's start it repair history so the repair history is about the scheduled maintenance and other repairs done on your engine so scheduled services have been done like regular intervals your engine oil has been changed filters has been changed have you used genuine oil or genuine filters or duplicate filters have been used can be an issue so that need to be looked into then usage of the machine that means it's a old machine it's a longer period used engine or machine then the reasons for overheating are more like a clogged or f a cleaner element so check the air cleaner element if the air cleaner element is clogged with uh, dust then adequate amount of air is not going through the filters into the inlet manifold so check the air cleaner element uh, that's very important then defective contact of valve and valve seats that's an internal thing but when it's an old machine that can be a problem worn piston rings and cylinder liners the piston rings on the piston get worn out so the compression can leak into uh, the engine so there can be an issue the cylinder liners can get worn out so the uh, oil gets combined with the compression that can happen clogged seized fuel injectors also can be a problem in uh, old machines okay so these are the probabilities if it's an older machine then let's see like color of the exhaust gas how it is changing you should question yourself or the person who is coming to repair like is it suddenly changing to black or it is gradually becoming black so these are two different things if it is suddenly changing to black that means 95 percentage you have a seized turbocharger or turbocharger is getting some interference that means it's worn out or it's not properly giving compressed air to the intake manifold so that could be the main reason or there could be other reasons like stuck seized fuel supply pump plunger the plunger pump is stuck or it is not properly working you can check manually that or the clogged seized fuel injector itself can be a reason if it's a sudden black smoke but if it is happening gradually that means if the black smoke is coming gradually the clogged air cleaner element will be the reason you can see the air cleaner element and you can 95 percent you can be sure that it is clogged that's why a gradual black smoke is occurring but if it is not the other reasons could be like leakage of the air between turbocharger and the cylinder head or the clogging or seized fuel injectors or you can see like worn fuel injector the fuel injectors over a period of use get worn out that will cause a problem so maybe that can be the reason okay next a blue smoke under light lot just ask him has he ever noticed a blue smoke coming while there's a lighter load given onto the vehicle when you accelerate for a lighter load there's a blue smoke coming or not blue smoke is associated with the burning of oil 
when oil burns blow smoke comes so you can see one piston rings and cylinder liners can result the compression to combine with the oil so that can be one of the reason if blow smoke is coming then like three of them covered the fourth question will be non-specific fuel has he used a non-specific fuel like petrol instead of diesel diesel the vice versa or corroded uh, fuel or fuel which has been stored for a longer period of time with him like stuff like that can result in this or he has missed kerosene into the fuel uh, to increase uh, his economy so such things can result um, in a black smoke clogged seized fuel injectors could be another reason so these are very important then the fifth one is engine oil added more frequently just ask him like was he adding engine oil more frequently that means this engine oil was consuming much more faster than the normal rate that's why he was supposed to add more engine oil if that's happening that means the engine oil is going somewhere where it is going it is leaking for a black smoke it is burning off maybe the worn piston rings or cylinder head can't result in that much more oil is getting burned more carbon deposits so it can go black the smoke can go black the th sixth one is the power loss suddenly he is accelerating his driving suddenly he feels that he's not getting the power he's throttling up it's not ha coming so 95 percent the reason would be seized turbocharger and this will be associated with the black smoke your turbocharger got seized it's not working it's not compressing the air and not giving the compressed air to the in inlet manifold so that's it black smoke associated with a power loss which is sudden so turbocharger need to be replaced with that issue if that is the cause otherwise a crushed or clogged muffler can also create this issue third one is stuck seized fuel supply pump plunger and the fourth one is clogged seized fuel injectors so these are the major analysis that you have to do uh, if there is a black smoke then you need to go to the checks then the last one is troubleshooting which could be the possible reason how to clear it off so keep tuned to us subscribe to us for more videos and the other part two and part three videos the checks and the uh, troubleshooting part of it if you like this video please give us a thumbs up and if you have any doubts feel free to drop a comment below we'll respond to it 100 percent or you can contact us on our whatsapp number which is mentioned over here so this is our channel id uh, do subscribe don't forget and please share with your friends this will be beneficial to others also and if engineering students or mechanical engineering students automobile engineering students are watching this video what i have to say is we are giving whatsapp updates to them just send us a whatsapp message we'll support you by clearing your doubts or whatever it is and project support etc so keep tuned to tech freaks info connect with our facebook page or our social media in the description we have given uh, entire links so keep in touch have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.